for the WWE Championship. And here comes one of my favorites. Ladies and gentlemen, as a reminder, the championship is on the line here tonight. And in looking at the opposition, I can say that the champion will have quite the hill to climb in this one. He's been undergoing a lot of training for tonight, not taking this title opportunity lightly. The Beast! The most decorated combat athlete in history. Brock Lesnar is hazardous to your health. No emotion, no remorse, just simply poised for absolute destruction. That is the beast incarnate Brock Lesnar to a T. Introducing the challenger from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, a superstar! And his opponent from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 286 pounds, the WWE Champion, Brock. Social media is buzzing, as it always is, when this title is defended.
There are no pinfalls, submissions, disqualifications, or countouts. The only way to win is for a superstar to force their opponent inside of the casket. After closing the casket lid shut, the remaining superstar will be declared the winner. Now, let the match begin! This is a match type that no sane superstar ever wants to go through. A casket match. Brutality, savagery, absolute terror. All of those are considered positive qualities to have in a match like this. Anything goes all in service of tossing your opponent into the casket and shutting the lid tight. We could be witnessing someone's funeral tonight. Reversal, can they go on the attack? Both superstars showing great awareness of their opponent's repertoire. Superstar. How the hell did they survive? Taking this outside. This could be good. Wow, oh, Brock way lays him. Getting carried around. Bad spot to be in. for that effort. Look at this. Pendulum backbreaker. Tick tock. Just one step ahead. Reciprocating the initial reversal. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage here. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Put it in position now. Oh, man. Tossed back into the ring. Unloading with an uppercut. Down to Odin, and a double axe handle smash. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. An example of the destructive force that only Brock can bring. I shudder to think what went through his mind when he picked up the shovel. Brock Lesnar avoids contact and sends his opponent into orbit. Lesnar looking to bait his opponent into a mistake. Oh, my God. No one wants to be inside of a casket before their time, but sometimes that's the way it is in this match. It's bound to happen soon, but you can't let that scare you. Don't fear the actual casket. You don't have any reason to panic unless you find yourself in it. He's got the answer for that one. Ringing the arm, looking now for a top wrist lock. But this opponent still fighting back. Oh! Not ready to put the lid on this one yet. Apparently closing that casket is easier said than done. Taking this one back to the ring now. A face buster knee smash. That looks painful. He's taking this to the floor now. Incredible reversal into a DDT.
He's able to fend off the attack. Knee right to the midsection. He'll head to the ring. Outside the ring now. He has no need to rush. Tough position to be caught in here. An extremely perilous position in which to find yourself. Oh my God, even worse. All that happens now is the casket is closed and the match is over. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Boom. Strikes with a kick. Vicious knee. Re-entering the ring now. Heads out and he... Oh! Lester! Oh no! Brock's got the Kimura! This won't win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage in the process. Look at this, he let it go. Curious decision there, Michael. He's heading back to the ring. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. He's got him in the crosshairs. From the top. He's able to combat out of Brock's grip. Hoist it up. Nice suplex. What a spine buster. Looking for something, anything under the ring. He grabbed the chair. Uh, now would be a good time to run. Those last hits rattled the champ. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Oh, man. These are dangerous attacks on their own, but now the damage is exponentially multiplied. Oh, uh, caught him. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Pedigree. They are primed for the casket now. But after that move, do you have the energy to get them in? Oh, big elbow drop. Everything working against Lesnar now. We hardly ever see Lesnar in this alarmed state. Fighting back with a counter. Now Lesnar looking for some momentum. Could be what Lesnar needed to reawaken the beast. And he slides him back to the mat. Ow! Being carried around with ease. As they're pulled, oh, almost into the casket, and now they are. All you gotta do is shut the lid. He's back into the ring. The Beast is feeding off the energy in the WWE Universe. Knee to the gut. Tossed into the casket. It's about to get very dark in there. Doing their best to try and close the casket. And then they survive. I can't believe they actually made it out of the casket. And he's taking this to the outside now. Ooh. Uh oh. This isn't going to be pretty. Suplex. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Breaker. And that's going to impair Brock even more. Pivotal time now as the Beast is in real peril. That's absolute power with a vertical suplex. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Dropped face first onto the casket. Was mounted with punches and not oh a nasty stop to finish it off. Mm. 
Tossing them into the casket. Close the lid, close the lid. Can they close the casket? But the, the opponent is trying to fight back. It's a they did it. They survived for now. we are going to be breathing a sigh of relief. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. A face buster knee smash. That looks painful. And back in the ring we go. Oh, Brock Lesnar may break the arm. Could be tap out time for more. He doesn't yeah. have much time before his arm snaps. Great job fighting out. Now that'll do some serious damage. What now? Oh, uh, stop right to the gut. He continues to press forward. He's in non-stop attack mode. He's looking for something. This could get dangerous. Clearly thinking a steel chair is what's needed right about now. Caught in a bad position here. Oh! Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. Now we're talking. This sledgehammer might be what decides this match. My goodness, the human skeleton shouldn't have to endure a smash like that. Boom! Running STO plants him. Nicely done. Watch out! They're coming towards the announce desk! What the hell are you doing, Byron? Brock is in complete command here. Brock's like a beast playing with its food. And these attacks are spelling nothing but trouble. It has been a constant barrage from each of these competitors. Lesnar caught off guard. Pedestry! We can have a new champion! And now thrown back into the ring. And what's he looking for here? And of course, kendo sticks are always under the ring in the event of any road ninja attacks. A face buster knee smash. That looks painful. Thankfully. Heads out and he has all the time he wants. Oh, the stairs right to the head. Way to steer clear. Don't put one on right hook. Oh, Brock. Come on, Lock. Come on, Lock. It's in. And look at him tapping. He's had enough, but it doesn't. Scenario. Oh! Lesnar wards him off. Oh, he got him. Is he going to lock this in? The cross face chicken wing. This won't win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage in the process. No, he lets him out. Yeah, I think he knew he wasn't going to get the submission there. And more attacks to his core could hinder his offense. He's burying elbows in the midsection. Oh, man. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Oh. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. Oh! 
saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. That may be the final blow that puts him in the casket. No, oh, no, get out of the... Desperately trying to force the casket closed. Their opponent showing massive risk. And the win has been shut. R.I.P. Here is your winner, and still, the WWE Champion, Brock. Big win as he retains the championship. He's definitely fought to keep his championship, and that's something he should be really proud of.